Hi and welcome to the Battle Systems tutorial video for the blast doors, um, the all important sort of uh, waypoint uh, to stop your enemy in games uh, getting through to the next section of your battle station, uh, etc. Um, first of all, all the parts. Now the blast doors are pretty much the same um, if they're a single or a double blast door, the process is the same. Um, it's just the base which is very slightly different. Okay, so um, single door, double door. With these, it's really quite simple. All you basically do is um, your internal support, if you like, one on one side, one on the other, and that gives you your double side. Um, then You've got your, your base, mounted base, which you glue onto there. Um, and across this line is basically <coughs> where you glue your blast door down. And as you'll know if we've scalped these out, that you sort of pre, this just sort of fits across the top, like so. <coughs> and this basically gives you your, um, your blast door. Obviously I've not glued it all together. The single door is exactly the same. With the single door, glue one on top of the other, like so. And you take this and glue it on top as well. The big difference here is that you've got two white squares. So you've still got the black line to show that you need to kind of put this this way. Um, You've got two little lines, uh, black, uh, sorry, two little white squares, should I say? Um, and all you need to do basically is cut these out. Um, the best way to do that actually is to <coughs> is to just cut those, um, glue this on first, and then just cut directly into both image and card at the same time. Um, once that's done, it's just a case of these. This part of the door here actually just sort of kind of slots in and glues in, and that'll become your single door. Okay. So, I'm just really going to do exactly what I just uh, told you there. So I'm going to start by gluing these bits and pieces together. Obviously before you start, make sure it all fits together. Okay, so that's all the bits and pieces glued together. Um, and or, as always, I would recommend that you sort of do these doors in batches so you'll be able to do sort of like a whole load of uh, doors. Um, and then that really gives the first ones that you did a good, good sort of good amount of time to dry. Um, but as always, I'm gonna just sort of crack on ahead. So there might be a little bit of movement here, especially if I tried to when I tried to scalp all this out. So I'll do that in a moment. Um, so um, yeah. Um, Basically, last but not least, make sure this thing fits over the top, which it does quite comfortably. Um, and we just need to sort of uh, glue it into place. Now, you've got to be careful now, you want to edge glue it, difficult because you've got it on both sides, so you want to kind of put a little bit of a bead just on the inside here. Um, I do have sort of uh, very uh, sort of small tubes of this glue, um, have a much tighter nozzle in it, ideal for this, um, but I'm just going to go ahead and uh, use the very tip of a bead to uh, do this. Okay, that's on there. Starting to feel sort of quite sort of solid-ish. Um, I guess ideally you want these to be as sort of level as possible. This one seems to be leaning a little bit. Just get it roughly in position. right um, just pop it off to one side and with these you might want to make sure that it kind of stays level as it's drying 
um, if you really wanted to a bit worried you could um, you could make a, a quick little sort of triangular V just to stick on here you could put one here one here wouldn't really affect it you could sort of cut it out of a print of the either the, the blast door or a print of here um, and that would give it extra stability if you was worried um, once the glue starts to dry though it should be fine I'll just pop that off to one side okay so over to this one now all I've got to do is scalpel out these little holes um, and again I've only just stuck this down so I might get a bit of movement here but I'm going to do my best There you go, um, that seems to fit quite nicely um, and again almost don't need glue with that one, it's quite a nice sort of tight fit but I'm going to pop some glue in there anyway. And actually when you glue in this, there's a bit of bead in there, I just need to pop that off. When you're gluing this, um, it, you're actually almost putting a little bit of glue actually on the printed image, which is normally, uh, you know, a bit of a taboo. Um, but um, these are actually be tucked inside, so it kind of doesn't matter. Okay, so that's your blast doors. Um, got a few of those to make. Thanks very much for watching the Blast Jaws tutorial video, um, on to the next video and um, happy gaming.